day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Love you. Hey, um, I just found on a, um, on my computer, you remember that uh, survey that uh, Kamal Bell put on that the uh, Project Implicit, where he took the, it's a, he took a computer test to see if he had any like uh, racial bias and the way he thought, I just found that. If you go to Project Implicit online, it's got a Project Implicit Health Link where you can go take this survey or take this test and it'll tell you how how you're lined up with your bias. Yeah. Towards blacks, towards whites, towards this. Exactly. I, that's the survey I sent. The military survey, I took that about a week ago. Oh, you did? Okay. I, I, yeah. yeah. Then it has some parts in there where you can write what you think and all this here. I had a field day with that. Yeah, I did and, too. Uh, I could have put one thing like, uh, you know, the fact is that you got there's those unwritten rules that goes into hiring practices. Yes. You yes. Know? I, I went in on that because I'm sitting here. How is it that I can have a supervisor that don't even have a degree in underwater basket weaving, but he's my boss because Chuck is his Chuck, who is his the uncle, is the one that put him in that position. Yeah. Well, that's that. There's a lot to that. Because from my understanding, when they made this base here, they went to Macon yep. and they went to uh, Perry and, and Fort Valley to ask for employees and everybody said no. Oh, so really? they went out to Cochran and Dodge County. all the families Dodge said County. yes. And they all came in and they all got the uh, positions of authority and power and they just brought in family. Yes, sir. So that's who's at the core of that base. Yep, that Dodge County Mafia. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> Deep, ain't it? Hey, so look, that was a good discussion today. Uh, anybody available for do the communion? Yeah, I can, I can grab some communion stuff. Okay. Chris, I think it was a good discussion. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It, it lets me get the bit a little bit and have a little fun, so I'm good. I, and, I, and, I, and I think it's valid to do I it. I look forward to hearing from, from, from Chris, because Chris, Chris. <laughs> I do, I agree, I agree I'm with him. I'm radical, I'm radical. <laughs> When Jimmy was well, Jimmy but, was right the all day. into the red zone. <laughs> oh, see, see, Jimmy is my calm down alter ego. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but he, he used that word. He used that word revolution. <laughs> Do you want a revolution? Hey, I think I think the whole no. Christian movement, the whole Christian the movement, thing, is no. a revolution. No, that's it. See, y'all think about it. If something, if something revolves, it goes back on itself. We need an evolution. We need Ev to go up another level. Evolving. Yep, I like yes, that. Sir. That's a, that's a better word. That's a T-shirt by itself. Yes, sir. Evolution. Mm -hmm. You know, because the bottom line is a house divided, house divided cannot stand. Period. Yep. You know, so uh, I think I think I still think we're moving in the right. Uh, direction. I think we move. I think we have come a long way. But we said a long but way you, to go. But you said something in Pastor. You said that a house divided would not stand. I think that's so profound because you know what? In all honesty, even in the midst of all the things we're talking about, and in the midst of all this stuff that we're involved in right. right now, in all honesty, we're our own worst enemy. Oh yeah, yeah. You got that right, Jimmy. You you said you said a mouthful yeah uh and that's been our issue all along it's been embedded in us to be divided well you know they, look, they 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 took they took every measure into ensuring that we were always going to be divided even to the point of taking light-skinned blacks against dark-skinned blacks educated blacks against non-educated blacks uh, everything they use, everything. Kinky hair against straight hair. Big nose against little nose. Big lips against little lips. Everything they can to keep us divided 
against each other. And it's been embedded in our psyche to that we can't stand as a people on, on hardly anything. There's, there's this division with us on, on every front. Well, you know what, I, I want to throw, can I, can I put a balance on that too? Or at least some examples that, that when we do do that, sometimes destruction falls, comes after us, come behind it, not by us, but by the our counterparts. I'm talking about Tuscaloosa, right? Yeah. Tuscaloosa, that, that city where you had that black... Uh, yeah. Tulsa, Black Wall Street. Yeah. It, it was connected. They were working together. They were being successful. That's when this the system tried to came, you know, came in and destroyed it. Yeah, they so didn't try. Point, they did. Yeah, I know it. So my point, I guess, sometimes when you're showing that element of unity and, and, and togetherness, I'm first saying that we do have history showing that does happen, can happen. It is happening. But we also see where that's when sometimes the system try to come in. And oh, it, it will. It we, will always be because if we if we become self sufficient, then they lose out on the vast amount of money that that we put out into the business world. Right. We are a commodity. <coughs> We're a commodity on on so many levels. So many. You know. Levels. Yeah. From the prisons to the business, you know, yeah. we are a commodity. We, 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 we are nothing but dollar signs to these people, and and that's it. So, but as long as our money is being filtered through them, then it's okay. Yeah. But if it's filtered amongst ourselves, that's an issue that they're going to deal with, and they're going to destroy it utterly. Destroy. Words, it, yeah. It's almost like it's like a backlash, right? It's like when, when I think even when we and I think we agree that when the success of uh, President Obama, what we have now is a back. Chris, you think that's kind of like a kind of backlash? That is that is the truth. That's the yeah. only reason Trump the president. You yeah. see what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Came yeah. up with the Tea Party, then came up with Trump. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Well, that's, you know that's everything that we have amongst ourselves. It, it's it's. Uh, it's absorbed into their if it's successful they take it they take yeah. it okay. it becomes a threat see we i can't think those have our threat. own we can't even have black lives matter yeah they got to yeah, replace they, it they with all that yes, and then look they at this the first black network bet yes. for us all about us black commercials black stars black shows uh everything and then what happened? They infiltrated. They they couldn't let us have it. And then they're just they're. I think they're they're equal shareholders now. Wow. wow. Uh, Sony Sony owns that. The Japanese own own BET now. Yeah. Oh, really? So Johnson so, sold. It. Yeah. So it's it's we 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 can't we can't have nothing. Well, what, that's and that's what, and that's why I wanted to throw that balance here. I'm saying is that. We have that. I'm just showing there's our examples of us coming together, you know, to do things successfully. And then there's the opposition that shows up for those areas. As long as we stay within that boundaries of chaos, like yeah. the gangbangers and stuff, well, you know, they're shooting and killing each other. Oh, that's that's fine. You that's fine. As long as it's among each other. Each other, yep. they'll they'll allow it. They'll put yep. minimal resources toward it because but that if, feeds if into it, the narrative, doesn't it? If those young brothers were to unite, then that's when they will be marginalized, criminalized, and they will be in the front news again. Yeah, because they used to be yep. gangbangers used to be on the news all the time. The crib, you know, the blood, killing, drive by, drive by. Everybody knew every gang name. They even probably knew a lot of the, the hand signals and all that other stuff because it was in the forefront of the news because it was getting out of hand. It, it, then it when was, they realized yeah. that these were black kids black, killing black kids, then it kind of just fell by the wayside yeah. because it was fitting into their narrative. And yeah, yeah. What happened to the other one, Chris? What's that one, the MS-13? 
Who's that one that was? MS-13? Yeah, what oh, happened? They, they, they're not even in the forefront because they're killing one another. So that's it fits in their narrative. Yeah, but drugs, right? Yo, yo, no, your government helped establish that part of that. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Send it feeds into the narrative because all those feeds into the narrative and all the negativism and what feeds positive is what is a threat. That's the and that's what the people in Charlottesville, Chris, was was talking about when they said we're not gonna be replaced. They they won't worry about the gangbangers, okay. right? Or the druggies. They'll worry about something else. They'll worry about somebody got promoted to such and such rank over them you right? know something else you don't hear about anymore what's that you don't hear about the uh about the uh opioid epidemic anymore wow you don't hear nothing about these pills that 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 that, that was a giant issue for the white the community the oxycontins the oxycontins yeah. so you don't even hear that in the news anymore I don't hear about and that. Medicine, and that medicine. fell by the wayside before COVID nineteen. Yep. Yeah, that so, was killing a lot of people too, wasn't it? Yeah. Well, because they found out that you know it was just as many people of color getting involved in it as they were, so then they just let it go. And see, that's the sad thing is, and it's one of my this abstinism is something I noticed is you remember back in the day, black folks. You could tell what was going on or somebody something happened to somebody by the way they died or what drugs they were taking because black folks would only smoke weed and drink. Yeah. Okay. Then they they then like I said, slowly they got got like I said, some of the soldiers got hooked on, you know, shooting heroin and all that. But now with the new music, they doing this Molly, this perp this this and this that and they the, the music has dictated that everybody do all these crazy ass drugs so wow. that's why all that stuff has faded to the background yeah. it was an epidemic when only white folks are doing it. wow when black folks start doing it and black folks start dying then it's not an epidemic anymore leave it alone huh? well check it out what did it take for it to become commonplace with black folks rap music Rap music. Oh, yeah, but we, we don't even want to get into that one today. The, the, the one way that. that young kids accept information is through Dude. social media and Dude. rap music. D. And Man, that's, that's how they other, pump right, that stuff up. we need to, because faith comes by here, and you got bad stuff can come by here too. Oh yeah, it, it applies both yeah. ways. It applies both ways. That that is a a law. D. Yep. That, that's no law. different than gravity. D. Yep. Man, we got a long way to go. This will come. Hey, society is very complex. <laughs> well, it's 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 like I said. The world and this world system will forever be corrupt until Christ makes the change. I agree. Until God yeah. makes the change. We can't change it. All we can do is let is 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 to have god's will done here on earth through us and in the the christian community we can make a change amongst ourselves and even when we become one as long as we're separate they'll allow us to go to church but when this church becomes one and there is no no division between color or 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 uh nationality i should say yeah when there's no division there i guarantee you christianity will be like wiped out of the united states it'll be against the law Indeed. it will be against the law but as long as we're separate uh -huh. as long as we go to our 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 our, our, our separate corners you right. know if the yep. white churches go to the white churches and the black churches go oh christianity's fine yes sir it's mm. fine, but if we become one, wow, Which is it will one. definitely, definitely be against the law in the United States. They can't have that. They can't have that unity. 
because it is a whole nother form of government. Yes. Yep. And it is against this government that we live in. It's it is perfect. against every government in this world. Every government system in this world is contrary to the kingdom of God mm. and God's government. Gee. So they cannot have it. And these other countries realize that. And they're already systematically eliminating. But as long as, I mean, we have freedom of religion, that's fine. As long as we're separate. Separate. And that's what the enemy wants. That's the world system wants. Yeah. Where the body of Christ is, we need to come and say white brother, black brother, brown brother. No, and, and it shouldn't even be that. It should be brother. Christian. Yeah. Brother. Period. Yeah. Yeah. Those of like precious faith. Period. Come on, brother. See, that's it. So, and I think that's why he wants to keep preaching the gospel. Because we got to get it through. But it's more than that. You know, it's, it's, it's somehow, some way, the church is, ha it has to be re uh, uh, united. Yeah. There's some, I, I think, something, I something's it's, gotta give. You something's something gotta give, and, and, it's, and it's, it's something's gonna unite Christians as a whole. The Bible says something. Right, yeah. And until that happens, I mean, we're already, I mean, we got wars and rumors of war. We have yeah. earthquakes, we have volcanoes going on. We have nations rising up against nations. The it's, the prophecy is, is fulfilled. What Jesus said is happening, has happened, been happening. Yeah. But the body of Christ it's has good. not, has not reached the fullness of time and, and and i think that's where i think that's why we want to be able to keep ministering the word and unity and using the word because i think the oneness comes from that word it we is. know that it's his that word that makes us one i mean you can't find in 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 this gospel for this dispensation anything that 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 points to a race. Yeah. yeah. Unless it's the human race. Exactly. Jesus said, till this world receives this gospel. Yes. He did not say until white people. Right. Or black people. Come on now. He said all nations. All nations. All nations. Come on now. Here. Not receive, but here. Come on. This gospel. Come on. So it's 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 it's, it's we're, we're right. We're we're right there. We are right there. I can I can I can just you know how 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 when uh the troops <laughs> yeah. spin it up, yeah. get ready to, 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 to go to Batman, I could just see the angels and just just the host of of the heavenly, you know, the heavenly host. I think, yeah. Just like, yeah. You know, it's like it's it's about that time. Come on now. You know, check my my my, my gear, my my helmet. Make right. sure my wings are are ready for this flight. <laughs> and and it's just like the excitement in heaven's got to be like, oh yeah, it's it's about to go down. Yeah, they can see something. They can down. see what they can see what's happening. Looking at God, yeah. Because it's God that's gonna say, it's time. It's and they're time. just looking at it in anticipation, you know. And I tell you, these times are, though it may be perilous, it is so exciting because I, I know without a shadow of doubt that I <laughs> will be in glory, man. And I'm, and it's, it's just stirring something up in me. Is stirring something in me right now. Right now, because it, it 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 really replaces all the issues on this earth. It does. If you put your mind on heavenly things. There's nothing in this earth that can take your joy away. Right. Amen. Nothing. And you know, I think in in, in the close of this, you no, know, 
the world wants to paint us as, as, as in a certain picture. And I was looking at that, that green leaf yesterday. You know, it's on Netflix anyway. It's, you can see how the world wants us to be. You, you, you've seen the show, right? I, I, I refuse. I know of it. I know of it. it but, but, but the point is, right, you, it, it's, it's, it paints the picture of what they want us to be. Oh, and I ain't talking about color. I'm talking yeah. about just the church. Yeah. Yep. It, it wants to paint corruption. It wants to paint everything you're talking about with dealing with the flesh. Mm -hmm. That's what it's trying to paint the church to be. And then they got that other one, Saints and Sinners or whatever it is. Yeah, I, I, forget, I lost track of that one. Is that, is that on uh, BET? I mean, that on uh, yeah, cable? I think, yeah, I think that's where that one is. I watched okay. that. What was it? I went home for something and my, my sister was binge watching. I watched about four episodes of that. And you I was see? like, yeah, I'm, hey, that's every, that's everyday church around here. That, that, that's see? exactly that's how they do it. See? Our churches, our churches are so geared toward our physical senses. It's, it's a shame. It's a shame. It's a, it's a total shame. The aesthetics of it, the, mm -hmm. the, 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 the musicianship, the, even the word that that's what that's what's so sad even the word that comes forth is geared toward a physical response exactly and, and it's so sad yeah it's yeah. so sad when it's all it's it's all about the soul mm -hmm. because the spirit has already been dealt with come on now it's the soul and they're not feeding the soul they're feeding the flesh yeah, I like it. With the matter of fact, that scripture, you know, when we first started all talking about desiring the, the sincere milk of yes. the word, and then you was some the other ones, and before that, after those other scriptures, they're talking about going to meat. Remember, yeah, we have put people desiring, too much on. desiring, desiring. non fat milk, Chris. <laughs> Look, these Woo! folks, they got folks, they can't even handle milk, it's, it's similar. It's similar. It ain't even milk. <laughs> See? <laughs> it ain't even milk. They can't even tolerate the milk of the gospel. Come on. It's got to be a substitute. See? You know, that's, a, that's a message right there. It is. Yeah. That's it a is. They're giving them, hey, giving them Similac. Yeah. <laughs> and they won't grow. See? It's like that's the point. Similac versus milk. Come on, bro. Mm -hmm. That's a message right there. That's the title. Well, we'll have to work on that one. <laughs> hey, <laughs> who did, you want to do the communion for us? Because we ain't got no bishop or uh, elder or, or Brother Jackson. Go ahead, Pastor. We, got, right. we got a pastor. Amen. Let's go ahead. Let's pray. Dear Father, I thank you, Lord, for this opportunity to come and worship and fellowship. Father, we thank you for the word that we have done today. And we ask you, Lord, to bless this bread that, that is in our hands and represents the body of Jesus Christ and that his, his body was broken for us to grow. The seed died so we can grow. Father, mm -hmm. we, we remember what Christ did so that we can also be examples in our own lives to go and show that we're willing to be living sacrifices to go to put the gospel before us. I ask you to bless this bread. I ask you to bless our lives. I ask you to continue to remember who you are and to teach others to understand who you are so that we can change this world through Jesus. Thank you, Father, for what you're about to do. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. We break and eat. Dear Father, we thank you, Lord, and actually bless this cup to represent the blood of Jesus Christ that was spilled on Calvary. Father, we thank you, Lord, that this blood washed away our sins. This blood unites us because now we have that G-type blood. Glory to God. We have that Jesus blood in us to make us JC one. positive, Father. I thank you, Father. And Father, I thank you, Lord, to continue to remind us that we do this in remembering what you did. You spilled your blood for our salvation. And we stand in the gap as the body of Christ to do your will. Yes. I ask you, Lord, to bless and protect us until next time we meet. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 You may drink. Well, brother, I hope y'all have a good week. Yes, yes sir. Hey, try yes. to, um, yeah, we try to be on Thursday. If y'all get a chance, try to dial in. Yeah, I, uh, there's this, this, uh, 
Zoom meeting I had with the Ujama, that the video I showed you, of, that that just happened. I, and I apologize. I was all caught up into that meeting <laughs> and uh, did, didn't think that it was Thursday. I know, I get uh, it right by you. Thursday, sneak right by you, tell you. Yeah. Yeah, I remember.